Hi people, welcome to my channel. Today we will learn about how to take the rudder and how to curve. But first, I wanted to suggest you that subscribe to my channel. Up here, I will leave the playlist with all the driving tutorials that I have done. You see it. If you like, you subscribe to my channel. The first thing we have to learn to do is learn to take the rudder. We learn to, to take it in position 2 to 10. It is as if the steering wheel were clockwise. We must always take the steering wheel with both hands to give support to the steering wheel of the car so that the rudder never turns if we step on a hole. A speed reducer or any obstacle that is on the road, always with the two hands here. Why? Because it's the position where we have more mobility. If we hold it louder, let's say position 3 to 9, I have less mobility than if I hold it in position 2 to 10. Then the best position for maneuverability and firmness is here. There it maintains a balance. How to go straight? There are people who have problems and go against the platforms. They start to go in the other line or very in the middle. So there is a way that we must practice a lot so that it starts to work out. But it's a guideline that we can have to be able to drive straight. To be able to go straight on the road, eh, what we are going to do is walk straight, aiming at the middle in our lane. If we look at the driving lines of the road, we will go against half of the road by the center of the road. Then that doesn't suit us because you have to occupy your own lane. Then at this moment, we will look at the tail of the car that is in front of us. If we look at the platform, we will go against the platform. Then you have to look to the bottom. More of where this car is, it's a good distance, more or less 60 meters. 60 to 100 meters away and looking at the road. The floor looking for an obstacle, a hole, look at the obstacles that they can happen on the road. How to turn? You already know how to take it, which is in this position. But how do we rotate? Simple, to turn we cross our arms, one, two, one, two. And again to the other side. Then if we are going to give a curve, we start one, two, one, two, and straighten, one, two, one, two. It will be a mistake to do this and straighten out like this because the steering wheel doesn't go far to turn and the car goes very open. So how it will be in an exercise in practice? At this moment, I will only focus on talking about the rudder. In other videos, I talk about mirrors, pedals. In other videos, I will talk about passing cruises. Now, we will only talk about the steering wheel. At this moment, we are looking forward in the middle of our lane. To change lanes, don't forget to look at the central mirror first and the other mirror. To watch obviously that no car comes. If another car comes, the other car we will take the road because we are the ones that are changing lanes to turn to the left. Always the one that turns to the left has the stop. But if nobody comes, we can leave. Here look how I am straightening. And once right, I return to look towards the front and towards there I am directing the car. To change to the right lane, we look at the central mirror and the right mirror. We turn to the right. To turn to the right, we turn. Remember not to accelerate. The curve, leaving the curve, we look back, looking at the bottom. We have the guideline to straighten the wheel. Remember that 99% of the time, we must look forward. Once we get out of the curve, we can go back to the accelerator. Here we go straight. Looking down our lane to get around, we look at the tip of the car. We approach the platform. When we consider that the car is ready close to the platform, we straighten to then brake to have a point of reference. Let the platform cross in half between the two windshield wipers. That was how to use the steering wheel. I hope you practice a lot and it served you. Remember to like, comment and share this video. 
don't forget to subscribe to the channel to receive the best content of driving tutorials. That was all for today, bye!